even though season two of the treasure track still has nine days left in its runtime or eight days by the time i'm uploading this season three of the treasure track is looking like it will be the most insane season yet we have new leaks to go over that came out today david a posted a video about them so this is where i'm getting the images from and these are absolutely insane i cannot wait let's go ahead and get into what we're going to be seeing with season three of the treasure track so we know season two of the treasure track started a new system that had to that had to complete quests to get quest points in order to receive the rewards there were also 15 rewards and it took a lot of different uh lots of battles and questions answered and all of that many many uh questions and battles done in order to finish these tasks and i already did that in a video of the season two of the treasure track where i completed it but it took quite a long time and it took me like nine to ten days so yeah for me that's a pretty long time but this is going to be absolutely insane i wouldn't even be surprised if there was more than 15 levels but we're going to have to wait and see that has not been confirmed but with nine days left in this season two of the treasure track season three things were added to the code of prodigy so we have a lot to go over and these images reveal a lot of things so first off let's bring up this image which shows the uh promotional art for the treasure track we see just this is crazy we see a bunch of new items we see the new mythical epic the new astral uh, non-counterpart mythical epic that i talked about in my video yesterday and this is just crazy we have never had a new mythical epic in the seasons of the treasure track so far so the fact that they're adding a new one and not just a re-release is crazy like i'm this is great to get a new mythical epic in the treasure track whether we're getting a re-release for the monthly quest uh quests or not we'll be getting at least this new mythical epic that has been uh, very much anticipated since it was originally found we'll be finally getting that at the at the beginning of this month of may because treasure track season two ends around may 5th so around that time is when season three should be starting maybe just a little bit after the fifth or something like that so that's when we can expect season three to start and again here we have the full form of the uh astral mythical epic also what do we know we have two mythical epics two they are doing another re-release in this one and that is buzzra and that is so surprising but i love it a lot i mean two mythical epics in a treasure track we did not expect that for sure and i this is going to be great amazing everything that i would have wanted we're finally getting so many new things and the fact that we're just getting a new mythical epic in the treasure track is already mind-blowing but then two two that's insane buzzra and the new mythical epic we will of course know more information about that when it is added to the game I may or may not be making a video on that it depends on how close to the release of the treasure track it is added but we do have more to go over so let's go ahead and talk about it down here we see that the rainbow butterfly is going to be a reward in this season of the treasure track the rainbow butterfly was originally obtainable in the arc of light arena season in the harmony island arena and it has been unobtainable since and it is awesome that this is being added here it's kind of like the cool main lion being added to season one of the treasure track and it is updated to bhd at least it will be likely it's icon i don't know if it's in game sprite is going to be updated we'll have to wait and see on that but this promotional image does show the updated version of it 
it shows the, both the icon and the sprite, which I really do like the look of it in HD. And we are just very slowly going through them updating the uh, buddies and furniture to HD. That's very slow. Hopefully there is a big step ahead pretty soon, but we don't know that for sure. Next is a, I mean, what? This, this is a, man, this has got to be a new pet. I mean, just look at this thing. This is new, like another new item being added to the game for the treasure track. Not a re-release, just a new item. And I love the look of this thing so much. I would assume it was a buddy, but over here we see on the icon that it has a pet circle around it. So it's got to be a pet. And that's absolutely insane. I mean, first looking at it, just the colors, I love them so much. Like, it looks amazing. And it looks like it has like a music note as a tail. As part of its tail, at least. That is spectacular. And, I mean, when I would first look at this, I would think it looks like a variant of Dreamlet. But that can't be because that would be for an ultimate member box. And as far as we know, they're not doing anything else for uh, pet variants outside of ultimate member boxes. So I don't think that's what this is. This has got to be like a completely original new pet. And I love it. Like, even though it, it looks like a variant of Dreamlet, it probably isn't. And just... It's a musical pet. It has a musical note on its tail. As part of its tail, actually. It's got musical notes on its wings. On its multicolored wings. It's got a nice uh, light pink body, green legs, green antenna. It looks spectacular. Like, I love this thing so much. And that's just one of the, I mean, new items we are getting for this treasure track. And I'm just, like, my mind is blown also, we know that for another thing, we are getting the Stormy Buddy re-released for this treasure track. So, that's great. I have, uh, this was previously obtainable in the June 2022, I think, member box. So, well, glad to see it make a return. It's a re-release, just like some of these others. But what just makes this one so unique is that there are so many new things being added that is not very common for the treasure track usually it's a lot of free releases one or two maybe new items such as the morph marble snow puppy but this is of course not all of the items that we're even going to be getting we can assume that there are going to be even more items some furniture maybe another buddy and just wow like i'm speechless not really not technically speechless because I've been talking about this for like eight minutes, but I mean, my mind is blown. We are getting new items for this treasure track, which is insane. We're getting three pets. That is certainly what it looks like. We're getting an original pet that is new to this treasure track. We're getting two mythical epics, one that is a re-release and one that is completely new as well. So it'll only be obtainable for like however long the treasure track runs. So will this other new pet. And oh my goodness, I never expected this. This is going to be way more insane than I ever anticipated. And I think everyone anticipated. One thing I do hope that we do get for this treasure track is more for Mau Mau to do. I think Mau Mau should get placed in the elemental areas, sort of like Ula, but have to do with the treasure track. We'll see though, they may or may not do that. They may just limit Mau Mau to be a character just directly inside the treasure track tab, which is okay, but I would prefer it if Mau Mau had more to do. We'll see what they do with that pretty soon at the beginning of May. And I'm super stoked about this treasure track. These reveals are absolutely insane. And, I mean, the new pet? A new mythical epic? Two mythical epics? Three pets in total? Why do I get a feeling that this is Prodigy making up for the lack of m anything new in Springfest? Like, what if that was the answer for this? This was happening for this season of the Treasure Track. 
because Prodigy wanted to make up for not having anything new in Spring Fest 2024, they have heard our complaints about that. And specifically on the Prodigy Wiki, they said that they are going to be uh, talking to the game developers about our complaints and making sure our voices are heard. So hopefully we will have better festivals coming up instead of what has been already leaked for the festivals. But that's not what we're talking about in this video. We're talking about the new Treasure Track reveals. And I mean, wow, just wow. This might take even longer to complete because it might be even more levels, more than 15. That's going to be crazy. I mean, we see treasure points, so we're going to be getting that system. That system is staying. And I mean, just mind blown. I love this so much. I know I've said that a bunch of times, but it is truly amazing. So, what do you think about these new reveals for Season 3 of The Treasure Track? What do you think about the new leaked pet? What do you think about the new mythical epic that's going to be added? And what do you think about all the other rewards that have been found so far? Remember, there are going to be more rewards in The Treasure Track. This is not it. So go ahead and let me know all of your thoughts in the comments.